We live in a world of stress, a combination of pleasure and distress. People hardly find time to rest, as many find themselves doing their best, leaving the rest to rest in the loving arms of a living being called hope. Unfortunately, certain people lose their hope and their mental capacity finds it difficult to cope. They soon find a home away from home, driven away with a hopeless hope of returning home from their homeless home. My name is Felix, and here I'm high in the midst of the insane, even though I am sane. How did I get here? My uncle had just returned from the States. His name is Dan, and here is his brother, Taiwo. Oh, oh, oh. I can't believe you still retain your accent after many years of Just eight years. Eight years abroad, my uncle roots me. Even my kids, my children speak very French over. You don't mean it. Eight years ago, I'm not going to for just two weeks. I left the campus for Lagos to visit my uncle and you know Collect some stuff that he brought back from the States. He's such a very nice man. When my uncle was out traveled to Oshobo to visit grandma, I was home alone. So I decided to get myself a company. <laughs> Uncle told me we were going out to see a friend of his. I obviously did not know that he was bringing me to meet some new friends. So, you yeah. Okay. Yeah, there's something that baffles me about this situation. What? Yes, Felix. And um, he carried out some of the tests. I will discover that. It's okay. There's nothing wrong with him. Felix is not okay. He carried out a lot of tests. I will discover that there's nothing wrong with him. Felix is insane. Um, all right, gentlemen. Thank you very much. May peace be with you. Dan. Dan. Take a look at this harmless and gentle looking man. How, how would you say he's insane? Dr. Sam, be careful of a silent dog. How would you say that, Uncle? How would you say that? Don't I sound normal to you? Yes, this is not okay. I am okay. I am sane. You, you want me to live among bad men? Don't worry. All good ways. What did I do wrong? Well, um, actually, it's for this. Hey, not for this. Don't, don't, don't understand. Don't understand. You see, an R in there is like a day. And a day is like a whole week. Yes, doctor. It's hell in there. Sure, sure. So, I, 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 I am safe. It is you. I'm not sure. Felix! Yes, doctor. You make it sound like I've done something bad to you. What kind of uncle wakes up in the morning, drags his nephew to his car, tells him they are going to visit an old friend, just to realize that he is dropping it into a psychiatric hole? Now, tell him what happened. I caught him with four bottles of cough syrup. No, he emptied four bottles of cough syrup. What? It was two. You 
useless boy. malfunction and when your respiratory system malfunction what what do you think happened to your body i'm not sure about that but one thing i'm sure of shut up it does only one thing to your body do you know what that is i i i, I thought death yes <laughs> death but I, I i thought my i thought this thing my, my friend my friend used to tell me that i have these guys around me we roll together on campus Evening after the end of semester exams, we decided to put on the seven D level. Let's do this now. Ah 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 no, they never try with this syrup of it. I beg, no try. I'm licking me. Guys, are you ready to do whatever? Nothing. nothing. <laughs> you know what we do with this? <laughs> no shaking. Baba, I'm so relaxed. Licking it, licking it. Where is the jogger? Oh, Jose, where is the the next day I was leaving for Lagos. My big suspected that something was going on, so she decided to find out. Babe, I don't know why you're in a hurry to travel to Lagos. I really told you to chill so that we can go together this weekend. We made for this babe. I told you have to travel before weekend. And besides, I'm going to my uncle's place. Okay, oh, if you insist. Felix, what's with you and this cough syrup? Babe, I think you should go for test or something more because this is already beyond normal cough. It might be TB or something else. But haven't I told you not to snoop into my things again? But I wasn't snooping around. I found you that I was helping you arrange your stuff. Okay, okay. And did I tell you to? Did I? No, no. It's not like that. We are not really concerned about you. Mm, babe, I'm so sorry. Uh, no problem. Mm? Are you still angry? Say I'm sorry. No problem. So can I come pay you a visit when I get to lag? I don't know about that one yet, but let's see how it goes, shall yeah. we? Yeah. Sure. Yeah. Oh. Oh, Dave, I'm going to miss you so much. I miss you too. Ah. <laughs> 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 See where pressure has led it to? 
Um, anyway, Mr. Dan, I, I'm very sorry for doubting you at first. Thank you. But this is what we are going to do. We will take him back to that ward where he belongs with his friends. Thank you. And then we will look at him for over time. Uh, Faru! <laughs> don't, don't go, please talk to Uncle. Faru! Oh, Uncle, please talk to Doctor, please. I cannot go in there. Please shut up. We take this patient to the ward where Yellow and Co are. Ah. Doctor, you know how that works. I, I can't keep you. <laughs> Alright, call Biggie to help you. The two of you should take him there as fast as possible. Call him now! Uh, I, 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 keep quiet! No, no, he's not. How you take him? Four months. When you are in good frame of mind. I promise, I'm not going to come back to work again. Please, I can't take him. Take him, take him. I can't put him in there. It is like air in there. No, no, no. Trying to prove sanity is vanity. Denying oneself of the ability to think right denies one free freedom, which one will later have to purchase with tears begging for reconsideration. After doubts of one's sanity have floated the mind of others, whatsoever is contrite remains wrong, even when the majority believe it is right. Say no.